So, two folks today, folks, on the political landscape. I hear today that if the general election was today, the Tories would lose by an absolute landslide, one of the biggest losses in history. They'll get absolutely battered by Labour. Uh, to that end, rumours are it's going to be in about November of this year. We've got a lot of work to do. On the back of that, we're in about old Nigel again. Old Nigel Farage has come to the fore yesterday. Um, he's debating now very seriously whether or not to come back into politics. I would suggest he definitely is. And they are saying, is it Clacton in Essex? I wrote it down. I think it's Clacton in Essex. Is it Clacton? It is Clacton. I didn't know Clacton was in Essex. I thought it was in the heart of London. That Clacton in Essex is his favourite destination. There's been a Tory boy in there since 2017. And they're saying if Nigel runs for Clacton, he'll most certainly win. He'll most certainly get it for reform. That's what they're saying. So, it's looking like Nigel uh, is going to enter the political landscape yet again. And it's not looking good for the Tories. Well, we know that anyway. Tell us something we don't know. Um, they've got a lot to do in the next 10 months, but I think Nigel coming into politics and reform getting even stronger is going to help them less and less. I think it really is. But anyway, that one will run and run. No doubt we'll hear more from Nigel later this week. And as we do, I'll mention that on here to you, if you don't mind. That's it as it is at the moment. I don't know much else at this moment in time, folks.